We are in National Line and we have found a great little cafe that is doing all homemade pies, mince and onion pies, cheese and onion pie, they've got lasagnas, fantastic breakfast options. Oh, this place looks a real treat. Let's go to Time to Eat. Follow me, let's go eat. Time to eat now, we've got Julie and Debbie. And Julie, I believe you have some pretty amazing pies. I've heard in the grapevine that they are some of the best pies in Ashton. I'd like to think so. I think so, yeah. It's, yeah. it's a meat pie and a cheese onion pie. Minced beef and onion. Minced beef and onion. onion. Yeah. Right. So proper traditional, like, and they're all homemade, everything's made on site. Yeah. Wow. Not just do pies, do you do quite a lot of other things as well? Yeah, we do breakfast. Breakfast yeah. blankets, bagels. Right. Um, and a massive salad. Yeah, yeah. So you, do. You, you're, a, you're a cafe artist, yeah. so you're open from what is it, eight till eight till two. Eight till two. Yeah. Um, so obviously the breakfast thing is obviously the main part of it. You know, I, I'm, I've been past a few times and it's mad busy. You know, it gets about lunchtime. Yeah. And it's just huge and busy. Um, and, and you do other things as well, like you've got is it lasagna? I think you said you yeah, do pie. Yeah, lasagna, yeah. cottage pie. Right. Like through the winter, soup, homemade soup. Oh wow. Yeah. So the pies you make on um, on certain days, uh, it's like the minced beef and onion is Wednesdays. Wednesdays. Cheese and onion. Friday. Friday and the lasagna. Well, lasagna Tuesday. Tuesdays, yeah. yeah. And is it just the three main things, or do you, do you throw things every now and again? We do as well? different things. I like to. I like to have the minced beef and onion on a Wednesday and the right. cheese and onion on a Friday and we mix it up the other days yeah. just so that people don't get fed up. Yeah, yeah. You know? But they're so popular, it's like once they've gone, they've gone out, yeah. they're just selling out. Yeah, once it's gone, yeah. it's gone. A lot of it's pre-ordered as well, isn't it? So yeah. people are only pre-ordering them. Yeah. yeah. So you need to pre-order these pies that are good. Uh, and, and then it's just a case of you make a big pie for the day and then when it's done, when that's it's it, gone, it's gone. It's gone. Yeah. Sounds amazing. Yeah. Today, obviously, we've got the, the two pies. Uh, and it's a, it's a breakfast wrap, which is like the most popular, yeah. right? most, one of the blanket. best selling breakfast, breakfast blanket. blanket. Yeah. So what's on the breakfast blanket? Cheese, mushrooms, right. sausage, bacon. Right. And then it's wrapped in a wrap and put onto the, the grill. Oh, to crisp it up. Yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah. Oh, that sounds good, yeah. I don't like mushrooms, so I think I'll have to have mushrooms off mine. Take them off. I, I don't like mushrooms, but I'm a fun guy. Oh. <laughs> Sometimes there's not mushroom for anything else on them because of that pack. Oh, so, there you go, you see. You go. Not mushroom. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it sounds amazing. Uh, so what we'll do, we'll, um, we'll, we'll go through the process of the pies and then uh, we'll see you guys a bit. So this is the, um, the, the dough mix. Yeah. Water goes in and that's just left then to mix together into the dough. Yeah, just mix it all together. Dough's already been done. It's we've just rolled it all out, it's all yep. been rolled out and now the next stage is to line it into the pan which we buttered earlier uh, and then we're going to let that all get settled into the pan and then once we've done the meat, maybe the meat and then it has a lid as well. It has a lid, has yeah. A lid as well. And then it's then it gets an egg wash. Egg wash and then yep. into the oven. Yeah, oh, into awesome. the oven. So do the meat's in the pan now and it's Aberdeen Angus. Yes. Aberdeen Angus as well so you get the proper quality steak. So the onions we've already done, they've all been reduced down. Yeah, they'll be added sharp. Pull it in and then I add the onions and then we do the gravy for it and then we strain it. Right, okay. So that we get the gravy off all this, the pie later. And we've got a few secret ingredients that we can't tell anyone. Yeah. <laughs> so now it's just a case of into the pie pan. Yep. Awesome, let's do it. And it goes. So that's the lid goes on. All oh, looks good. Wow. So Debbie, you're on egg washing duties. I am. Best job. So it gets washed all the, all over, it and then does. how long into the oven? Um, usually about forty minutes. Already smells absolutely amazing. Really good. Beautiful and brown. Nice. Cheese and onion pie time. Yes. That is a lot of cheese. The two cheeses that you use. Two cheeses. Yeah, and then it's got the onions are all boiled down, mixed in. Yeah. And then it's just all laid in, lid on again, egg wash in the pan. Absolutely Straight fantastic. Yeah. Proper cheese and pie. No Proper potatoes inside. No, not <laughs> potatoes. Awesome. <laughs> there we go. Pie's in. Minced beef and onion coming out. Minced beef and onion coming out. Minced beef and onion coming out. Julie, these pies look amazing. So we've got the meat pie and the cheese and pie. Yeah. So the meat pie is with the mashed potato, uh, veg, and gravy. Yeah. And the cheese and onion we're doing with chips and beans. Yes. 
So you gotta have chips and beans with chili and pie <laughs> and then meat pie. So we've got a bit of a mixture of both there. And you also you do um, a Philly which is like a bit of a your take on a Philly cheesesteak. Yes. Okay, so that's with the steak, uh, cheese, yeah. peppers, onions. Done on the griddle. On the griddle and yeah. then in a, a Normally has mushrooms, but right. we're not. Normally has mushrooms, okay. okay. Yeah. We're not having the mushrooms on it, I'm not looking forward to that. So uh, well let's uh, let's get plated up. Check out all this food, We've got all these pies that are made, these massive homemade pies, got the meat pie. And the cheese link pie, the mashed potato, chips, and beans. Got the, the little their take on the Philly cheese steak, the Philly cheese, uh, Philly witch. And then we've got the uh, most popular selling item, the breakfast item, which means the, uh, the breakfast wrap. Uh, that looks actually decent. So I think we're just going to start with the breakfast wrap. We are really nice. Love the cheese, that brown sauce, all melted in there. Crispy on the outside. That's really good. Oh yeah, pretty much everything in the shop is like homemade, wow, I must admit this is uh, something I'm looking forward to. Mm. Wow, that's proper nice, a little bit of mustard coming through, crunch from the onions, really nice beefy pieces of steak with the cheese. That's a proper night combination. Now, just simple, cappy food, absolutely fantastic. Got a little bit of the extra twist there with it. Got all the ingredients for the Philly cheese, really, really good. But I think the main event, the homemade pies, the mince and onion, and the cheese and onion, with all the traditional sides that's supposed to come with each one. Got to be chips and beans with cheese, got to be mashed veg and gravy with the mince. Anyone who has gravy with a cheese and pie must be crazy. Look at that, guys. Wow, oh, it's amazing. It's so beefy. All that stock, the bouillon, everything that's in there. The pastry is really, really crispy. Oh, wow. That is a proper nice pie. I can see why it's so popular. And the homemade mash as well. Got really creamy mashed potato like gravy. That is so nice. So smooth and buttery. Wow. That is really good. But that pie, that is definitely worth coming down and checking out. That really is absolutely amazing. So nice. I can't believe the amount of cheese that went into that pie. It was like that. It's all melted down, all dissolved in. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> wow, that is really, really good. There's so much cheese, it's so rich, it's creamy. A bit of pepperiness there. I put a bit of extra pepper on it. Got the chips, got that chips and beans. Heinz beans as well. That is proper decent. Overall, this food is great. They've got such a massive menu. All those different specials, different things on different days, well worth coming down and checking out. Breakfast items, decent. Deli sandwiches, jacket potatoes, just, just all sorts. And they make so much of it fresh in house. A lot of time and effort, a lot of work put into all this food. And it really shines through. Oh guys, that food was absolutely amazing. Time to eat in Ashton, great little place. Those pies are so good, I am so full. I think I need to go have a lie down. I want to say a big thank you to Julie and all the team here at Time To Eat. Big thank you to you guys watching. And you know what it is with me, Liam Marley Eats, always Time To Eat. So we'll see you in the next video.